New at five, the next weapon in the battle against the spread of coronavirus at public events is dogs. As Team 12's Mitch Carr reports, COVID sniffing dogs could be the way to get people back out to events safely, like arenas and stadiums. Almond sit. Good. Seek. Canine Almond is a wonderful dog, but she is not a pet. Long time. Seek. Yes. She's a working dog. And it has some scent holes in it. This small disc that Almond just found gives off the scent of TNT. Almond is being trained to detect explosives. And Almond's trainer, Jesse Keller, says you can train a dog to smell for cases of COVID-19 as well. If there is a strong odor that we can detect with the COVID, all we need is the training aid. Good. When Keller mentions a training aid, that's the thing that gives a dog the scent. In the case of COVID-19, the training aid is something we all wear every day. They're actually using um, masks. So people that have COVID, they're taking their masks, they have them wear it for a certain amount of time, and they're using their masks as a sample. Why dogs? They have about 50 times as many smell receptors as humans. As humans, you get a hamburger and you smell just the hamburger. You're like, oh man, I'm hungry. But a dog can smell each and every point of that hamburger. They can smell it, the bun, the lettuce, the tomato, the burger, the cheese. They can pinpoint everything. Good girl, let's go, come on. Keller isn't training COVID sniffing dogs yet, but it is happening. They are already being used by the Miami Heat as part of a plan to allow fans to see basketball games in person. So could they be used to get more fans into the stands here? Coyotes considered it, but are using different technology that relies on information provided by fans. The Suns, D-backs, and Cardinals have chosen other methods as well. But until the world reaches herd immunity, dogs like Almond could provide one way of getting fans back out safely. Good girl. Mitch Carr, 12 News.